Okay, welcome to the homestead. Today we're going to talk about our chicken coop and the things that I like about our coop that we built. First thing we want to talk about is the egg box. I have uh, six egg boxes on either side and we have about 20 layers. So I have about, uh, I have six boxes that I'm currently using for laying. We can check for eggs on the from the outside. Oh, three eggs there. If I don't want the chickens to use the egg boxes, or if I just want to clean the box, I can take the egg box out, I can clean it, and then if we don't want them to use it, I can just turn it around that way. Another thing I like about our coop is our pop-out doors for the chickens to come in and out of the coop. I can open them from the in or the outside, and then at nighttime I can close the pop-out door so it keeps them secure and warmer on the inside on the cold nights. I have pop-out doors, one on each side of the coop, so I have two entrances into the coop. Another thing about the coop is I have lots of windows in the, in the coop. For uh, winter time, I can close them all up on, on all sides to keep the chickens warmer at night. And in the summertime, I can open all the windows, provides a lot of draft, and the, uh, the chicken, chickens can stay uh, a lot cooler during the summertime. Okay, now on the uh, inside, you can see the nesting boxes on the side and the perches towards the back of the coop. So I don't have to walk underneath the perches at all because they really get messy after a couple nights of the chickens roosting there. Now, another thing is a little bit different about the coop. The size is 12 by 12 square, but I've divided the coop in half. And so I have a door I can close off one side of the coop and keep birds either on this side or on the other side. I also have a passage door on both sides of the, the coop. So when one, if I have uh, birds of different ages on one side and then younger birds on the other side, I can have interest, entrance into the coop from either side. The chicken run is 12 by 16. And I made it uh, long enough and wide enough so at some point in the future, I can divide the chicken run in half to keep different flocks on either side of the run. And so in order to do that, I put two, two pop-out doors on either side of the run. And I can close that up at night and they're secure on the inside. If you enjoyed this video, please click the thumbs up button below the video. It really makes creating these videos worthwhile. If you want to make sure to never miss a new video, be sure to click the subscribe button. Now you can get your homesteading questions answered. Visit us at our contact page on anamericanhomestead.com and send us your questions. Maybe we'll pick your question for a future video or article on our website.